Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Liz. Thank you for stopping by. To have, today I have some things from G uh, GBFKE. This was sent to me free of charge. Uh, Nathan reached out to me, asked me to uh, review his items or their items, and I am I'm happy to do it. So I got a few things in here. This is the bag that came in. It's just a simple plastic mailer. Um, I did open it because I wasn't sure who was sending me what. So let's start. Let's start. Okay. All right. So the first thing I have here, it's actually kind of cool, is this pen. It's a diamond painting pen. Let me see. This wasn't expensive. Might have been maybe a couple dollars. Let me see. Let me see. Wow, that's pretty. And it has like a rainbow effect. You see it? I really like that. Um, how does this work? Hold on. All right, so that's... Well, wait a minute. Let's see. How do these work? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Huh. Okay, I literally just pulled that off the top there. And that's the single placer. Okay, I, I have to like yank it so it clicks on. I'm assuming this one does the same. But boy, you have to have strength for, or does it unscrew off? Or you know what? I actually don't think this part does anything. I think it might have only been this part. Yeah, I think it's just one thing. I. Because I think when I looked at it um, online, I, I think this is just for effect. Like, it just looks pretty. But that's really pretty. It almost looks like rose gold. It's hard to tell in this light. It might be rose gold. It might be regular gold. I, I, cause I'm just seeing if it's close to... It might be actual gold because that those are gold rings. I don't know. It's pretty either way. <laughs> All right, next. There's a couple of cute things in here. And uh, smaller things, and one bigger one. Actually, yeah, three. With the with the pen, there's four four things in here. Okay, so let's go with this one. This one is really cute because I just did a video with a cross stitch, and this is a very similar painting. I'm guessing it's a um, sister painting to to that one. But the other one was cross stitch, and this is actual diamond painting. Okay. Today is Halloween. Happy Halloween to those who celebrate it. So look at this. This is a toy store. Or this one is. Oh, this is a coffee. The other one was a toy um, shop. This one's a coffee shop. Isn't it pretty though? It's so pretty. Let's see. Let's look at the drill field. Which is nice. I can see it quite well. I'm hoping most of it comes out. You know, it is kind of a small painting, but I didn't think it had a ton of... Well, it's got good glue, though, I'll tell you that. Definitely has good glue. Let me see if I can unroll it or roll it back. Now, the, the um, canvas really is pretty soft. It's not one of those really stiff canvases although it's that more plasticky feel canvas now that didn't do anything so to god that made it worse <laughs> anyway there she is is it a beautiful and this here says what does that say something tea uh coffee room what does that say fine tea is it fine tea's coffee room Coffees, fine teas, coffees, food. <laughs> That's what it is. Fine teas, coffee, food. Or foods. I think it's so pretty. And came with the kit. The basic, your basic kit. And this is, it came kitted up, which is nice. And it's got these really pretty colors. Let's look at the drills are nice. Which will look good. And got these colors. Now I'm surprised it's not 
Let's see if there's, oh yeah, this is like gray, because it's more of a gray blue, you know, and you got some of this pink. We have, oh, we have red. There's red in there. So yeah, that's going to be really cute. Um, I'm going to really enjoy doing this one because it's going to work up really quick because it's only a 30 by 30. So, oh, it's got 24 colors and it's all letters. Yep. And the DMCs are there too. So, all right. So that's that one. And then I thought this one's a special. I thought this one was going to be really pretty when it was done. <clears throat> this one will be really nice to put out for uh, Thanksgiving. Because this one I'll be able to do really quick. Okay. And this one is like crystals, which is nice. Let me see. I'm going to try to do the same thing with this one. This one's definitely have to be iron. So will that other one. This one's a little bit stiffer. Just a little bit. Oh, that's so pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? I love this so much. I think that, that is absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. Let's see if the glue. Oh, what's going on here? The glue is good. There's a couple. Yeah, yeah, the glue is good. I, I thought this wasn't, but it's just my hand hit this little piece here. And this has only seven, believe it or not. Um, that's going to look up really cute when it's done, though. Really cute. I just did a Christmas one. Maybe when I do this one, I'll do both together and show you what they look like. All right. So let's see. What do we got for colors here? Let's bring this up. It's not look good, though. Not pretty. Oh, I'm going to show you the drill field. Very clear. I mean, you can easily see that. Usually with specials, there is not an issue with the drill field. Not for me, anyway. All right, so we have this pretty... It's it's kind of like a peachy yellow color. I can tell. This is more yellow gold. Like orangey color. Uh, red. More like a deeper orange. It's deep. And, oh, actually, it's a lighter orange. Yeah. Lighter orange. Then we have green marquee and red dots. These are quite large. That's going to be so pretty. Ooh, that's going to be a fun one to do. Uh, just sitting here at the table having coffee with my husband. That would be nice. Let's put that to the side. And that came with uh, the typical, your typical kit. Okay. And we have one more. Now, this one came folded over. <laughs> Honestly, I generally wouldn't like that. Let's see what it looks like first when we open it up. Because this one's quite large. This one's a 50 by 65. And he told me they have to wait a little longer for this one because this one they have to print up separately. Um, if it's the kind of material I think it is, this will iron right out. No problem. You know, or lay flat. If you lay it flat, it'll come out. Usually for something like this, though, I... Or for pretty much everything, I just iron it. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. All right, so this has 39 colors. And this opened the long way. I don't know if you guys noticed that, if I even showed you. It opens this way, which is nice. Easier to get back in. And this is a Christmas painting. Oh, yeah, this can be ironed out. This is that material... It's, it's like a polyester, so you have to be careful with it, but it'll definitely iron out. Wow, it's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> okay. Um, it comes with a uh, a decent kit. This is like um, a better better kit than the typical one. You got multi two multi-placers. That looks like a four. And that might be a ten. And you're single. A glitter pen, a cush, four things of wax, and a nice tray. I like these trays. Oh, and a tweezer. And this this is in uh, squares, by the way. Yeah, I like this. Okay. Oh, there's ABs in here. Nice. I don't know. I don't know if I even saw that when I uh, placed the order. So let's look at it. Okay. Let me pan out. Okay. So it's a Christmas village scene. 
and I love it so much. And honestly, I think the rendering, I think it's going to come out amazing. This reminds me sort of the one I just finished with the, um, the girl, uh, the fall girl that I call her. It just has like that same, it's not the same material, but it's, it's got like sort of the same, um, rendering where it's, it's pretty, uh, accurate. And let's see, um, let's just show you this. This here, this is the legend and it's all over the place. You got numbers, letters, symbols, you know, and then you have your, your amount, which is this last row here, the amount of drills there are, and the DMC code. Um, now, I don't know. There's nothing here that says which ones are the A, B, so I'm just going to look through the drills, but I want to show you guys the drill field. You know, let's see. Let's pick out a darker this is pretty soft canvas. Look, let's look at that. So it's very clear. I can look. This is pretty uh, confetti heavy here, and I can see that drill feel really easily. I don't have an issue with that. Ooh, this one's gonna be fun to do. I have I'm working on the Thanksgiving one, and then I'm gonna be working on some Christmas ones. And I fell in love with this one, and I'm gonna show you in the. Um, what do you call it here? The thumbnail, what it actually looks like. And I'll have links for all this below, but it isn't that beautiful. It's just a pretty Christmas town. Um, I believe that right there is a train. I can't remember for I, It's hard for me to see because you know, the thumbnail is not super clear, but um, no, it's not. It's a, it's a window. I thought there was, I think there was another one I was looking at that had a, a train. Um, there but i just think it's so beautiful i love this so much um i think that this is going to come out looking really really pretty i have um i have to just make the space for it <laughs> the time i should say because i do think this is going to come out really really beautiful it's in the mountains you have like the smoke here the so now, oh, I think it's going to be awesome. Okay, so these are your drills. Look at these drills. Aren't they beautiful? These are so beautiful. Okay, let's look. I have not done a square from them. Um, did I do one of the round ones? Not yet. I haven't done one of the round ones yet. No, I just haven't had the... Time. I wish there was 15 of me and then I could do everything I wanted to do. Okay, so let's see how many ABs we got. We got one, two, three, four. Let's see, 132, 413, uh, ABs, oh, 606, and 720. Okay, so the numbers are all over the place. Let me see. If there's any more a lot of blue this light blue which is really pretty okay so it looks like there's probably just four babies um and this one what did i say 50 by 65 all right so we have two hmm. these look almost the same exact color that's weird i don't know are they the same color or not it's hard to tell but they, I'm going to have to look in my, um, my drill sheet. It's not a sheet. It's a booklet and it gives you, uh, different, um, uh, the different colors and you can like match it up because these look very similar to me. I'm wondering if it's, if they are the same or if there's like, this might be more of an orange. This might be more of a red. That's 606. That's, I'm sorry, 666. And this is 606. So it could be that. I know 666 is bright red. And then we have this really pretty gray. I really love that. And this really pretty orange. So this is more of an orange. Yeah, this, these two, you know what? I'm going to get my thing and I'm going to look it up right now. I'm going to pause this for two seconds. Okay. I got my little handy dandy uh, color chart. I, get, I always forget what to call it. I love this thing. So all I do is I look back here and I find the number 606. And that's on, it's right there, 606. And the black will tell you that that's on row 14. 
So I go over here, I look up row 14, which is right there. And then I just look for 606, which is the last one here, which is like an orangey red color. And yeah, it does match. So if you put it up close to it, you'll see that it usually will match pretty well. Sometimes it's a teeny bit off and sometimes it's not the right, not the right color. I've had that happen. Um, and then the color 666, same thing. You, you would think it'd be in the same thing, but they're not. And that's on row one. You go over here. And we're, okay, so there's 666 right there. And that's the color for 666, which still looks more like this color. You know, in this light, it's hard to tell, but this is definitely, I think, more orangey. Hang on one sec. I'm going to go look under my light that's like daylight light. All right, I checked. Honestly, it's slightly different, but not by much, but it is slightly different, okay? So these are the colors, and I'm assuming they're going to go be going around there. So you probably, honestly, if you mess these two colors up, I don't think it's going to matter. Um, let's just take a quick look at these drills. Let's look at them. Let's bring them up closer for you. I mean, they look decent. They look like they're pretty uniform from what I can see. They look nice. They're sparkly. They look nice to me. I'm working on DAC one. Boy, does that one have... It's the, my first round DAC, but boy, does it have lots of sparkle. But these are nice. These have a good amount of spark. I actually think this is going to be really nice. Um, I forget. They weren't. These aren't expensive. It might be like maybe fifteen dollars, something like that. Which for the quality, I mean, if you look at these drills, they look decent. They look nice to me. You know, they look quite uniform actually. With, with the squares, that's the trick, is to get a more uniform. With the rounds, I don't think you can tell as much. Even sometimes they are a little bit different. I don't think you can tell as much. Anyway, so that is my um, mailing from GBFKE. I thank Nathan very much for allowing me to uh, review these products. I, I love them. I think they're... They're a budget-friendly company. I think for the price, you get, like, very good quality. Like, this is really good quality, I think. I mean, it doesn't have the, what do you call that, the um, scalloping in the edge. I mean, as long as you're careful with it, you're not going to have an issue. It does have the legend on both sides, so it's got it on that side, and it's got it on this side, which is nice. So, um, and I think... Let me just measure real quick just to see if it's true to size. Hang on. Okay, I'm back. Um, Howie, don't bark. Please don't bark. My neighbor, I have new neighbors moving in and Howie's uh, getting, <laughs> getting frustrated with them. All right, so let's see. Okay, so this is actually true to size. It's fifth, uh, I'm sorry, almost true to size. It's 49 or just a little under 49. No, it's 49. Um, so it's supposed to be 50 by 65, so it's 49. It's just a little bit under, rather than the ones that you get on Timu, which are quite a lot under. And it's supposed to be 50 by 65. And this one's just a uh, little under, um, I'm sorry, a little over 63, about 63 and a half, almost 64. So that's, that's not bad. I mean, that's really good. Very, very good. <clears throat> so, yeah. That's my GBFKE mailing. I love it. I thank you very much. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, oh, that I didn't check the glue. Hold on. <laughs> uh, the glue is really, really good. I find that with these other companies, other than Timu, most of the time, the glue is fine, except for those couple of companies I've had to deal with. Um, most of the time, I haven't had much of an issue. But now that I check it more more often, but this one has a really nice, if you can see it, it's got a nice glossy, hold on, glossy uh, layer there. I think this one's going to be fine. I can't wait to do this one. It's so beautiful. All right, you guys, have a great day wherever you are. At, if you celebrate Halloween or Samhain or uh, some people celebrate um 
All Saints Day tomorrow? Is it All Souls Day? All Saints is tomorrow and All Souls is the next day. Whatever you celebrate, have a great day. Have a great time. Enjoy it. Um, keep your eye out for the lunatics out there because, you know, life is crazy right now. But just be safe, protect yourself, and watch um, watch the – watch keep – Keep up watch of your surroundings. That's all I have to say with that, you know, because we had too many tragedies lately. Um, but hopefully you'll have a great time wherever you are. Take good care of yourselves. Blessings and thank you.